The Karachi Multi-Drug Resistant TB Control Program runs out of Indus Hospital's outpatient department where identified patients are registered, enrolled and followed up at weekly clinics. It is Pakistan's first GLC-approved community-based model for treatment of MDR-TB. All data for this program is collected electronically on OpenMRS using the MDR-TB module, which is endorsed by WHO and GLC. After the patient has enrolled and started treatment, a treatment supporter is assigned and visits the patient's home twice daily to monitor consumption of medication. We are currently piloting the use of OpenMRS Mobile by the treatment supporter during household visits. Using the mobile phone, we can link data from the field directly to the patient data in OpenMRS in real time. Here's an example. By using GPRS, the treatment supporter can download patient cohorts, download patients, download forms, or search for a patient either directly on the server or locally on the phone, and then enter the relevant form during the household visit. In our directly observed therapy form, we can quickly get important information like which dose was administered? How much of the dose was taken? Were there any adverse effects? And finally, that data can be saved and uploaded instantly. Not only that, we can also collect GPS locations to ensure that the treatment supporter did in fact visit the patient's home. The program also delivers a monthly food package to the patient's home that includes items like flour, rice, lentils, milk, sugar, and oil to help with the basic needs of the household. This is especially invaluable in the case where the patient was the primary breadwinner and is now unable to work due to the disease. Enrolled patients are called in to Indus Hospital for monthly follow-ups. Here is an assigned open-air waiting area solely for TB patients. During these visits, patients meet with a clinician who enters details about the visit in OpenMRS. Here is an example of data stored in OpenMRS. In OpenMRS, you can see a patient overview, the regimens they're on, encounters that may have taken place, graphs of body weight, the status, lab results and drug regimens, DSTs and bacteriology results, contact tracing, and so forth. The patient also meets with the nutritionist after their weight and height is measured. If they need to be put on food supplements, they are shown how much to use and are provided with the necessary supplies. After this, they also get individual counseling and encouragement to continue with their treatment regimen. Finally, they provide sputum samples for culture and smear microscopy and any other lab tests that may need to be taken are carried out during this visit. The patients in this program are also screened for HIV. Treatment supporters come to Indus Hospital to collect the necessary medication from the dispensary at regular intervals. Finally, program managers can monitor their patients using a visualization tool developed by IRD. Patients are mapped geographically based on the GPS location of their homes. A quick patient profile extracted from our OpenMRS database can be viewed by clicking on a patient. That was a quick overview of the Karachi multi-drug resistant TB control program run out of Indus Hospital in Pakistan.